In a second-hand set of dimensions, in an astral plane that was never meant to fly, somewhere in darkest Ankh-Morpork, a sinister plot is about to unfold. week for my usual special. Hey, <laughs> what's where you going? See you soon. Get off. Leave me alone. Damnation if you don't clear out so help me, I'll, I'll... Oh, just bugger off. <clears throat> That's better. It's on nights like this I could just murder a good curry. Would you mind putting your hands up? Why? What's happening? It's a simple courtesy. I say, put your hands up. And you, put your hands up. What did you say? It's traditional. A well-established ritual of your actual mugger and victim relationship. You being the victim and me being the aforementioned mugger. Now please, put your hands up. Hold on to you, what's the names? I haven't got all night, you know. Just do it, all right? OK. OK. I don't know what this town is coming to. A man can't even have a quiet drink in peace. <laughs> now, that wasn't too hard, was it? Now, if you'll just... Oh, bugger. Unseen University, the home of the greatest wizards on the Discworld, and one or two of the worst. Now, listen carefully. With all these rumours of a dragon... But, sir, dragons don't exist. At least, not unless people believe in them. Quite, quite. Nevertheless, with all these rumours of a dragon on the rampage, the wizards of Unseen University must fulfil their civic responsibility. We must seek out this dragon and destroy it. Yes, but how? Who? Leave the how up to me. As for the who, well, I know of the ideal person. 
Why don't you go and fetch Rincewind for me? The Arch-Chancellor wants to see you. Ah, if it isn't young Breakwind. Rincewind, sir. Rincewind, quiet. Come in. We need to talk. That is, I need to talk. And you listen. No doubt you've been hearing all sorts of rumors about this dragon that supposedly is terrorizing the town. Uh, uh dragon? As in the uh, classic far breathing, city toasting. Shut up! Yes, pretty much. Scaly, vain, like shiny objects, that species of kidney. And what we need to do is to ensure that the unseen university is properly represented in the attempt to dispose of it. If some yokel simply slays the wretched thing without our help, the people will begin to ask just what wizards are for. Actually, sir, what are wizards for? Wizards are firmly behind big dinners. And if you want to keep on eating yours, you'll go and see about this dragon. Surely, sir, dragons don't logically exist. Shut up! Dragons exist if you believe in them. And the average man in the street does believe in them. Or at least believes in them enough to give us big rewards if they think we've gotten rid of the thing. Do you follow me? Not really. Shut up! Not interested in excuses. Too much sloppy thinking around here. Run down to the library and fetch me a copy of Featherwinkle's Concise Compendium of Dragon's Lairs. Once we've read that, we'll know how to track the scaly blighter down. You still here? Standing around like something unhygienic? Do it now!
Excuse me, my dear sir. Could you get me a tome called Featherwinkle's Concise Compendium of Dragon's Lairs?